This conference will now be recorded. All right. Good morning, everybody. I call the uh, Lake Stevens Commission meeting to order. It's June 22nd. We'll start with Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <laughs> All right, then bring us to item three on our agenda, public forum. Do we have anybody? Let's see, do we have any down? Any cards and letters? To the virtual wall, anybody would like to take the floor? I'll give a minute. Two or three. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. All right, we'll close the public forum. We have a beautiful agenda in front of us. How do we feel about our set agenda? like to make one change okay. under consent item C investments the dollar amount should read three hundred and sixty nine thousand six hundred and forty one and twenty cents all right any other adjustments all right do I uh, I'll entertain a motion to uh, go forward with the agenda as corrected I make a motion to approve the agenda with the correction I'll second that no in favor Aye. all right Okay, very good. Um, we have some consent items, A through I. Uh, how do we feel about these? I like them. We'll go ahead and make, I'll make a motion to approve consent items A through I, and of course, with that adjusted balance amount that uh, was previously recommended and changed. Okay. I second it. All in favor? Aye. 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 That brings us down to old business six. We'll start with A, list station eight, upgrade DEA addendum extension right. of latecomer. Period. Uh, this DEA addendum will extend the latecomer recovery period for a private development funded upgrade to the station eight um, due to the area subject to the latecomer having been in moratorium. And that had been adopted by resolution 782 back in 2007. So this action, uh, the uh, moratorium action, may have hindered property owners in the recovery area of the latecomer basin from connecting to sewer. So as such, the moratorium may have limited the recovery potential for the latecomer owner. Um, the owner of the latecomer has requested that the recovery period be extended until December 31st of 2030. The addendum is consistent with the conditions necessary for the extension of the reimbursable recovery period. Um, as cited in RCW 57.22.020, subsection 2, subsection A. Uh, and this addendum has been reviewed by legal and is recommended by staff for approval. Okay. Questions, comments? I think we've talked about this one before in different yeah. ways. Okay, um, and I assume we just need a uh, maybe a little vote here on authorizing you to sign? Yes. Okay. And so I make a motion to. It's actually going to be signed by the commissioner. Uh, approve um, okay. item A on our old business, which is a lift station eight upgrade DEA addendum extension to the late pay period. Okay. Second that. All right. Call for the vote. All in favor? All Aye. right. Aye. All right. I'll pass it. We'll sign her after. All right, bring us to B, updated contract amount for actuators and clamps for engineering process control. So this is an item that we had discussed at our last board meeting. Um, district staff previously, previously, sorry, at the last board meeting, had requested a not to exceed budget of 85,000 for the actuator replacement project for the treatment plant. However, the quote use it, used um, was an outdated one and we've received an updated quote. Um, the, the stated price of the project should have been $93,926.37. Engineered process controls is still the lowest responsive quote that we've received for the project and it's still recommended to award them the project. Um, and then staff is also requesting that the board consider a not to exceed budget of $100,000 for this replacement project. Okay. Comments, concerns? Nope. No. Okay. Nope. Do you want to uh, articulate that into a uh, motion? Sure. I'll make a motion that we 
proceed with the updated contract amount for the wastewater treatment plant actuators and clamps through engineering process control inc with a increased quote amount but not to exceed one hundred thousand dollars second that all in favor aye. 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 all right bring this down to the skater switches project update all right um district staff is requesting the board consider a proposed change order to the wastewater treatment plant switch gear replacement project uh, had been awarded to Syrian Networks in August of 2022. This change order will provide additional servo modules, sorry, and accessories which are necessary to complete the project. The cost of this proposed change order is $2,860.74 and is recommended by staff for approval. And then also request that the board authorize the general manager to execute the change order. I can see from the quote that we have some Cisco Catalyst products uh, on here. Since I work for Cisco, I'm going to recuse myself on this one. All right, so I would, um, there is no other comments, questions, concerns. I'll go ahead and make a motion um, to uh, authorize the general manager or designee to work with approving the wastewater treatment mess data switches project update with the additional cost and lead time appears to be $2,860.74. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Excellent. All right. Brings us down to new business, which there is none, which brings us right to manager's reports. We have one manager. All right. <laughs> Here we go. Flow at the plant right now is 2.57 million gallons a day. Uh, we finished off May with a total inorganic nitrogen of 48,332 pounds for the year. That's 38% of our limit. So we're doing wow. great. Oh, we're doing really, really well. Um, GFCs this, so far this year is 27.07 collective. And we've sold 75 permits. We're going to do so well on that nitrogen that DOE is going to look at that and probably reevaluate their limits. <laughs> well, we already know they're going to lower it. Yeah, I know, they, I know. They told us that up front. <laughs> I guess they were they were probably just mentioning the earlier limits to get everybody like, uh oh, but I plan on lowering it as long as I'm not spending money. <laughs> yeah. Uh, long as long as you know we know. That brings us to uh, City Report. I see Gene. Welcome. Good, good morning, everybody. Uh, business as usual, but I did want to report out. Uh, we talked about it at the utility committee yesterday that the sewer extension design is underway for 131st Avenue Northeast. That'll go by the public workshop. So we're excited about that. And then the parking lot for Millspur is under construction. That's all I have to report. All right, fantastic. Thank you. Brings us to commissioner's report. Let's start with commissioner number one. Hey, why not? <laughs> uh, good morning, everybody. I just want to say thank you to staff and everything for all the hard work that's been going on. I know it's a busy time of year. Summer is now upon us, and and we've had a lot of a lot of projects going on, a lot of movement in there. Do appreciate all of this work from the staff as the financials and everything. So much and that, so it really helps us kind of give an understanding of what we've got going. But other than that, um, yeah, there's just a lot there. Thank you, everybody. Okay, Commissioner number two. I have no report today. Right. Commissioner number three. I do. I don't have anything to report either. Uh, um, I'm assuming we're having executive yeah. session day. Do we have an idea on time wise? Um, let's start with 15 minutes. 15 minutes, so we'll go down to 925. Uh, yeah, Jack, do you want to give the preamble? Sure. The Lake Stevens Sewer District Commission will now move into executive session pursuant to RCW 42.30.110I to discuss with legal counsel representing the agency matters related to pending litigation or threatened litigation at this time. The executive session will conclude at 925. At the conclusion of the executive session, the commission anticipates no further action will be taken. 
This conference will now be recorded. All right, we're back in our regular session. Uh, as I uh, discussed at the beginning, no uh, decisions or actions therein. I would entertain a motion to close our meeting. I'll uh, make a motion that we uh, adjourn. I second that. All favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.